Now on the line. Uh, Ms. Wandule, this, I guess, is uh, quite a big story that's just broken. Tell us about this redeployment of the finance minister. Uh, Peter, as you've had uh, a very good evening to you and the viewers, the president has issued a statement informing the nation that he has replaced the finance minister, Minister Mtatani, with uh, David Van Goyen, uh, who was the chief whip uh, of the finance in parliament. And you'd remember he also used to be the executive mayor of the Merafong municipality. So we are at the event where the president is expected to speak to business people. Um, we, we assume he may say a thing or two um, after this uh, 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 announcement that he has just made. It, it, it will be very interesting uh, to hear what he may have to do, he may have to say, given that uh, finance minister was speak by and large with these people and uh, the president has just taken action um, given uh, what uh, he considers uh, is the right, uh, um, right environment uh, for him to I'm sure that people are, must be speculating as to the reasons why he may have been moved uh, uh, so quickly after uh, perhaps uh, the way the decisions he took around SAA last week. Um, there would obviously be a lot of speculation, Peter. You know that uh, uh, our economic situation currently in the country um, is uh, looking good. And there's a lot of factors and there's a lot of decisions that need to be taken. And um, you, you can imagine um, the, the, the portfolio, like the, the Treasury, is very key in some of these things. So I, I would assume uh, a lot of what has been happening may have informed uh, the, the president to take the kind of a decision he has taken. But he has indicated in his statement that uh, he will be then announcing um, a new deployment for Ntantan and so we, we, we don't know if it will still be in the, in the economy sector or in the financial sector. So we'll actually wait and see. But it is a big decision that uh, he has taken today. What do we know about uh, David Van Rooyen, apart from the fact that he was uh, former mayor of Marafong? Is he working in Treasury at the moment? Where is he coming from? He's been the chief whip in Parliament um, uh, of, on the Portfolio Committee on Finance. And uh, you see, is it's, it's a person who is really no stranger to issues relating to treasure and finance. So I think it will not be completely new to him uh, when he assumed this position. And I would assume there would have been a lot of discussions that uh, went on. And uh, given that already he deals with a portfolio around those issues, he must be seized with issues that uh, the country really is faced with. All right, so people have been speculating for a while that there might be a cabinet reshuffle in the offing. Uh, the names of Ntlantla uh, Nene, David Van Royen, have come up. Could there be more in the coming days? Uh, you, with President Jacob Zuma, it becomes very, very difficult to, to predict what his next step will be. Um, I know there's been speculation that... Uh, some sort of a reshuffling is coming, given that we know there might be some briefing later on during the week. So the speculation was around, uh, is the briefing about the, the, the end of the year, or is it the briefing about the reshuffling? Given that the name of uh, Nkanta Nene was also being touted, so now that action has been taken around that issue, it makes it very, very difficult to speculate. We would have to wait and see as the week progresses. All right. Um, has there been any uh, response, reaction or statement uh, by the former finance minister in Tlantlanene? The statement has just been issued, uh, Peter. I would assume uh, he may not have had time to, to speak to anyone as yet because I think the president has just informed the nation. Um, but I, I'm not sure whether there would be reaction. You know, ministers serve at the pleasure of the president. So he, he, he hires and fires uh, when it didn't fit. So it would it, 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 it be very interesting to see what's going to happen. But what, what perhaps we'll be more interested in is what new deployment in London is going to be given. Uh, I think that will give us an indication of why perhaps this decision was taken.
Okay, Swendelin Beje Natar, presidential correspondent, uh, speaking to us on this breaking news that the former finance minister, Tlantla Nene, will be redeployed uh, to an as yet unnamed or unknown uh, portfolio. And uh, taking over his position is the former mayor of Mirafong, David van Rooyen. And for Bakshni, I guess this is the kind of news the RAND might react to, the markets might react to during the course of tomorrow as they digest this information. We'll just have to wait and see. The RAND hasn't been performing well. We've also just been downgraded. So possibly not the best time for this mm -hmm. to happen in terms of uh, the international investors looking at South Africa. But for now, that's where we leave it. Tabiso is standing by with the very latest in sporting action. Tabiso?